Hi there, my name is Shannon Allen with Aroma Boutique Aromatherapy and I'm making some products for a girlfriend of mine who just recently had a baby. And I wanna make her something that is safe to use while breastfeeding and something that will uh, help uplift her uh, if she starts to feel a little bit overwhelmed and if she starts to feeling the baby blues. Uh, maybe you are someone who just had a baby yourself or you know someone that has just had a baby and you're out looking for ways to help mend your body or their body as well as their spirit and that's why you're watching this video now so i hope this information can help you or a new parent you know i would love for you to subscribe to my channel as well as like and share with someone that you know that this information could help. So listen, giving birth is the most profound chemical change in a human body that someone can go through in the space of just a few hours. It's shocking to your body and your mind. When I gave birth, I was so scared. I read baby books and there was nothing that would, could prepare me for the moment I got to hold my sweet child in my arms. It's very overwhelming, joyful, and frightening all at the same time. Well, it was for me anyways. After giving birth, healing your body is so important and healing your mind is also just as important. New mothers never forget that your baby's well-being depends on your own well-being and so anything you can do to make your life easier and happier, everyone benefits. Don't feel guilty about spoiling you yourself. You just spent the nights carrying around your baby and nourishing it. You have been through labor and committed yourself to a lifetime of hard work. Of course you deserve a little bit of pampering. In fact, you have never deserved it more than now. I wanna show you how to make this Baby Blues Rollerball Blend that can also be a bath oil if you wanna take a soak. So in this blend, you will need an empty rollerball bottle, comes with this little rollerball cap. You will need clary sage, bergamot, geranium, and a base oil like coconut jojoba oil or even olive oil if that's all you have. You will need four drops of clary sage, one, two, three, four, six drops of bergamot, one, two, three, four, five, six, and you will need four drops of geranium, one, two, three, four, and then the rest that you will add uh, your base oil, which I'm just gonna do 15 milliliters since that's how big my container is. You're gonna to wanna to stir and mix, stir and mix. And what's it's combined, I'm gonna need just a little bit more, okay? I'm gonna stir and mix again. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna to wanna to add it to your rollerball bottle. And I've poured a little bit too much, and then you're gonna to wanna to cap it. And there is a roller ball in there in that cap. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna roll it and roll it to blend it some more. And then there you go. You can rub it on uh, your wrists, behind your ears, um, on your pulse points. You can do it on your feet. Um, you can do it on the inner part of your elbow is a great spot to put this oil. If you're breastfeeding, I know your nipples can get raw and sore. And I know that you're worried about putting anything on your breast because your child will take that in when they're breastfeeding. That's why I recommend using Roman Chamomile Hydrosol for healing those sore, cracked nipples. Roman Chamomile Hydrosol is the number one choice for safe baby care. You can safely use it right from birth in the bath water. Um, also can be a soothing mist for bedding and mothers can use it diluted to wash the breast area. 
In addition, you can help prevent any cracked sore nipples. Its calming properties will make feeding time even more relaxing and soon babies will associate the aroma of Roman chamomile with mommy and yummy. Now, um, I have um, Roman chamomile hydrosol here and I'm gonna pour this into my bottle um, with a dropper. That way uh, she can use this Roman chamomile for a cold compress. And um, what you would want to do is pour the um, half of the dropper. Here we go. Half of the dropper you would want to pour onto a wet washcloth and um, add it to the washcloth. That way um, you can use it as a cold compress um, for your breast and you can help cleanse and soothe your breasts. Also, if you want to use Roman chamomile hydrosol for a soothing baby bath, what would you would want to do is use a fourth a teaspoon in the baby's bath at birth. And then once your child hits one years old, you can use one teaspoon of the hydrosol in their bath. Also, when your baby starts teething, you can add two to three drops into, the dro uh, into a bottle of water. Uh, this can help calm diarrhea and your uh, upset stomach, your baby's upset stomach. You can also rub the gums with a diluted Roman chamomile, dilute it in water. Uh, you can rub it on there frequently to reduce inflammation and swelling and pain and help soothe any associated crankiness of babies. I'm telling you, you can get so much use out of Roman chamomile. New mothers can also use a 50-50 blend of Roman chamomile hydrosol and lavender hydrosol to compress any tender skin for diaper rash. You can also use the blend of Roman chamomile and lavender as a compress or a sitz bath for postpartum relief. Uh, so you can take care of your tush and your baby's tush at the same time. And if you don't want to make these products, you can check out Aroma Boutique's AB Baby products. Um, I'll list the website link below. Thanks for making these products with me. I hope this information has helped you or somebody that you know. Click that subscribe button so that you can be notified when I put out a new video um, so that you can get wonderful information about aromatherapy that you can use to help improve your life and your family's life. Thank you again for watching. Take care. My name is Shannon Allen.